majority. All right, so I'm getting a B crow, which is about 20 cents sharp. So I'm going to record that. Yeah, 20 to 30 cents, I would say. So I'm crowing at the thread and then back on the tip. So on the tip, it should be pretty thin. And then on the thread, I should be getting some more pitches. Make sure it's all the way pressed down into the well. tuner and then look. All right, that's an A about 20 cent or 10 cents flat. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna go low A, high A. High A is in tune. Low D, 20 cents flat. And then middle D. About 15 cents flat. I'm trying really hard not to change my embouchure or anything like that after I actually start the note. Sounds flat, I think. Five cents flat. All right, let's go to these Fs. I'm gonna start with the natural F first, so that's one, two, and this little key right here. That's incredibly, incredibly, incredibly flat. registering as an E. It's registering as a sharp E, but it's registering as an E about 40 cents sharp. And then my left F. That's also about 40 cents flat. I'm going to do another C scale. This time I'm going to look at the tuner while I'm playing the C scale to see if anything is way out while I'm playing it. Okay, so F is pretty flat. And high C was also pretty flat. Everything else is pretty close to center, but a, uh, more of the notes are falling flat than in tune or sharp. Alrighty.
so in general for high school cadets and for Scarborough Fair, they're both pretty easy. It's pretty easy to play. There's a lot of responsiveness. I'm not really feeling very much resistance at all. Now, this is the only read out of the 10 that is not technically a medium. The way that vocal majority categorizes their reads is they actually have um, a basic, an intermediate, and a pro. So this is the intermediate, and they also have a lot of different letters next to their reads, and that signifies the read maker. So I decided to get an intermediate read, letter S, which they advertise on their website is their most popular read, and it's you know pretty free blowing, and, and there's not a whole lot of resistance, which I definitely agree with. There's not very much resistance when I'm playing this read. It doesn't have a lot of depth, and I'm kind of really thinking about my intonation as I'm playing because I'm hearing especially certain notes. Um, in, in this example, I noticed F, and it depended on the F that I was playing. Sometimes I played forked F, sometimes I played left F, depending on what's happening in the music, but that forked F um, especially is very, very, very flat. Um, so that's something that I would look out for if I was playing one of these reads. Uh, but in general, it's pretty in tune, but it is um, it is on the flat side. It is 69 millimeters, so I wasn't expecting it to be that flat because that's actually on the shorter side. So that is vocal majority. Mm -hmm.